Hey, you doing? This is my video review of the iPhone 4. It's uh, the 4.2.1. Um, as you can see right here from my settings page, you, you see it right there, the 4.2.1 setting. And so, <clears throat> this is it jailbroken, and some of the great advantages of it being jailbroken is you have programs such as iBlacklist. iBlacklist is a program that will let you blacklist people that call you such as telemarketers or other things um, for an example these are all the people telemarketers that have called me and I've blacklisted them so that they can never call me again it also has a feature such as uh, whitelist meaning that nobody can call you except the person that's on that whitelist you can activate this for a scheduler that you can have it run from midnight till six in the morning when you wake up or different times of the day this is the 4.2.1 registered version and you can get this from the Cydia store. Another advantage to having a jailbroken iPhone is that you can run the the Wi-Fi, MiFi. This is where you can turn on via wireless that you can have a wireless hotspot without AT&T or Verizon or any of those knuckleheads charging you extra a month. You can do it through the USB or even through the Bluetooth. This works really well, and I found it to be able to share up to five devices. Another one is the My 3G. This one, what it does is it activates for all the programs that you use, and, and it makes the program think that you are on Wi-Fi instead of 3G. It works great for watching YouTube movies on the go. And as you can see, I have the rest of my apps here. These are all just your standard apps that come, and you can order with um, the App Store on the iPhone 4.2.1. It would be my suggestion to jailbreak it and you get the full Cydia store um, from the Loader app. I did it with the Green Poison jailbro jailbreak from the iPhone to dev team. So as you can see you have your full Cydia store. You have everything that you would need inside of here.